get a free copy of Athium software using the link provided in this video description. When you sign up for an Athium Designer free trial, you will get an Athium 365 and 25% off discount. Hello and welcome to a new lesson. Today we will learn how to design a PCB in Athium Designer. We will start from schematic and then we will create a PCB and finally we will make 3D design like this. The circuit that we want to build is an IR sensor, so let's get started. First, we will create a new project from file, new, project, and change the name of the project to IR sensor. Then we will select the folder and hit create then we will create a schematic and bcb files in the project right click to the name of the project add a new to project schematic and the same thing to the bcb then we will save the files to the same file of the project then we will start with the schematic this is the circuit that we want to create. We need three resistor, one potentiometer, three photodiodes, and one comparator. If you want to know more information about the component, you have to go to Octopart website and search on the component that you want and read the datasheet of that component. So let's get the component from component and then we get the comparator. Potentiometer and finally the photo dials. Then we will connect all the components together according to the circuit. We can change that wire by using label net label Now we will change the resistor value If you noticed, there is an error because there is a many component have the same name. So you have to change and rename the component. And instead of rename it manually, you have to go to tools and annotation, annotation schematics and all on update change list and hit OK and accept the change, validate the change and execute the changes and close it close 
so the error is gone and every component have a unique name automatically so now we want to convert this schematic circuit to a PCB go to design update PCB document and validate and execute close then take all that component to the workspace and delete the row now we want to rearrange the component So now we want to draw the cover tracks between all the components. So go to route, auto route all, and hit route all. Close. Now we will change the board shape to fit all the components. So we will go to view, board planning mode, and go to design, edit board shape, and change the board size now it's perfect To see the 3D model of the circuit, go to view and 3D layout mode. There is a, some missing component from the 3D model like resistor, potentiometer and the headers. So we will go to GrabCAD and download that models and put it here. After open GrabCAD website, we will search on all the components that we will need and download it. First, we will search on resistor. And download that model. Then, we will search on pin header. And download that now we want to insert all the 3d component from place 3d body and browse for the components escape Now we want to put all the component in the right place. Ctrl F to flip the board and go to Tools, 3D Body Placement, Position 3D Body. Select the first leg, the other one, and drag it here.
Now the green color means there is an error. To solve that error, it's very easy. Just pull the pad under the component and hit escape. And that's it. And this is the final shape we get. Hopefully this video will be useful for you and thank you for listening. This video is brought to you by Antium 365, where the world designs electronics, and Octopar, the fastest search engine for electronic parts.